We're also, <laughs> also seeing some more stories. You know, we, keep, we cover this stuff every month, and it's almost like a broken record every month, the amount of times you see abortion being used to cover up pedophilia, and, and as we did with the Child Predator mm -hmm. campaign, we discovered that the National Abortion Federation Planned Parenthood facilities are running a nationwide pedophile protection racket. Um, in North Carolina, Johnny, you're, you're part of the country, a guy named Edward Walter Smith, 66 years old, been uh, convicted. He started raping his adopted daughter mm. when she was 11 years old. Got her pregnant when she was 16, took her for an abortion. No record of the abortion clinic reporting anything. No, no, none of the, the uh, uh, mandatory reporting gone on. So they did an abortion on this 16 year old girl and returned to him. He continued to rape her for another four years Ooh. until she finally got to be 20 years old and left home and re revealed it to somebody. Now he's gone to prison. And, uh, and that's why when these people talk about, well, what about in cases of rape and incest? Mm -hmm. This is a good example. This, this, what in the world do you want to have something like that in the incestual relationship? That thing needs to be exposed and that right. person, you know, this, this Well, let me tell you the other part of this thing, Johnny. The abortion clinic where this girl was taken and they didn't do the reporting, the people that run that abortion clinic ought to be going to prison right alongside yes. this guy. Put him, put him in the same cell for the same length of time. They, they really should. They, they are really as responsible should. for the rape of this child as yep. he is. Yep. yep. Exactly. They well, we're asked, the district attorney and the local police chief. Yep. And the people that, that just ignore this. Um, this this is this is probably, in my view, the most corrupt national tragedy that's going on in America today is this pedophile protection racket that the abortion lobby is running, and this is a perfect example. And by the way, this is happening, as you as we said here, mm -hmm. this is happening all over the United States today, and most of them will never get caught. This is just the rare one that got caught. But I've heard nothing in the media about the, about the authorities going after this abortion clinic. Mm -hmm. Nothing, and I promise you they won't. And if they tried to, attorneys for the abortion lobby would flood into North Carolina and defend right. the abortionist. Well, that's yeah. what happened in Kansas. Right. Uh, the Attorney General Phil Klein went after the abortion clinics on this very thing, and the uh, Center for Reproductive Rights flew in from New York right. and had a huge trial. And, of course, uh, the end result was uh, Mr. Klein was uh, drummed out of the state.